I'm excited. I am extremely happy. I'm nervous. <laughs> I am thrilled that I get to spend the rest of my life wishing. I feel real good. It's going to be a good day. Like, I'm not going to lie, I am nervous, but I, I know everything's going to be good. Looking forward to see Shane cry. <laughs> That's what I'm looking forward to. And seeing his face and his vows. Um, I'm excited to hear his vows. It's going to be a good day. It's just not just one thing. They kind of just make up, they make up a lot of things that, uh, that I really enjoy and admire about Amanda. When I can make her laugh, her, uh, her nose crinkles, and uh, just even the sound of her laugh, it's just, it's very heartwarming. His humor can make me laugh and smile and he calms me down when I'm stressed. I knew he was the one when we first said I love you and when we were able to have really long conversations and talk to each other all the time, I, that's when I knew he was, he was the one. Who does know how to do that thing up? Somebody does, right? It starts the bottom. Yeah, the bottom. Mm -hmm. So, okay. <laughs> just lace it. Mm -hmm. Just because <laughs> <laughs> I feel one of their dad, right? <laughs> there, it just happened one day where it was just like, this is it. Like, you, you need to, you need to propose to this girl. You need to marry her. Yeah, no, not anymore. Do. They don't know. Oh, because we had to adjust it. Yeah, I think that should work. Hopefully. Yeah. Yeah. Shane, this is a moment we've been waiting for for a really long time, and I'm so happy I get to spend the rest of my life with you and I'm so happy that you are going to be with me through all of this and I cannot wait for us to spend the next 50 years or more together. I love you baby. Let's, let's go get married. Let's do this. Amanda, from the first time we met, I just knew that there was something special about you. Your eyes, your smile, your laugh, and your personality. It's hard to imagine that right after we bo both met, both of us were traveling on a summer vacation for over a month, and we kept texting the longest messages back and forth to each other. We've grown together, challenged each other, and supported one another. I knew since our first date that you would be the key to my future. That you would make me happier each day. And the one who would expand my heart greater than anyone else has. I knew from those big blue eyes of yours that you felt the same. I knew since our first anniversary that you would be the one who would remind me of all the good in the world and remind me to stay true to myself. I have always known this whole time that we were meant to be together forever.
how to always be there for you, to give you a hug and listen on the tough days, to always make an effort and show how much I appreciate you. I vow to treat you like an Ed Sheeran song, to grow my mustache back, <laughs> to take care of you even if you catch the man cold, and I vow to save time for just you and I. I vow to always respect you, I love you Amanda, and never forget it. I promise to love you in every stage of our life, even if you have facial hair. <laughs> I promise to always be by your side, even if you're old and grumpy, because I will be just as old and grumpy. I promise to always laugh at your jokes, even if I've heard them a thousand times. But most of all, I promise to wake up every day and remind myself how grateful I am to have someone who loves me just as much as I love you. I've never seen Amanda happier than when she is with Shane. I've never seen Amanda more complete than when she is with Shane. And I've seen the smile and the happiness in Amanda when she talks about Shane. The way you described when you first met her, like, I could tell right then. Like, you guys didn't say anything. I was like, oh my god, man, you love this girl. When we finally got to meet Shane, I knew right away that this was serious and he was the right guy for her. Shane asked me what I thought of you. I said, well, Shane, she seems quiet and shy, but whatever you do, do not let her get away. Thankfully, he listened. authority vested in me, it gives me the greatest pleasure to pronounce you husband and wife. Congratulations, you may share your first marriage.